all you space engineers out there. Commander Kingfish here. And uh, this is the start of Season 2 uh, with the new uh, uh, program for uh, space engineers. I am going to be building uh, a base down on a new planet and right now we're in the uh, drop ship or the ship that's going to drop me onto the planet and as you can see we're out here in space and we're not immune to pirates and stuff like that so hopefully that's looks like it's going to miss us uh, and uh, starting to probably be as close as it's going to be so we're not going to worry about that uh, but I will tell you more about the um, Intergalactic Mining and Salvage Company. That is the company that uh, I have as commander has taken a contract out with to build them a new, uh, in essence, a new uh, uh, refinery, a renew. A renew a new processing plant and salvage operation on a new planet. So, uh, it looks like we are getting close to uh, time to, to hit the drop pod. And uh, again, I you think with all the science that they have that they'd have a better way of dropping us onto the damn planets or putting us on the planets. But we still got to go through the same old drop pod. So, uh, I'm going to go and get into the drop pod and get dropped, and I will see you when we are heading down towards the planet. Be back in a little bit, I think. I hope. Okay, well, as you can see, we are landing here in the uh, pod, and it would appear that... Uh, we're not too far from uh, shore, uh, so we should be able to uh, get enough resources that we can convert this to some sort of rover, which is kind of the plan at this point. So let's uh, get in here and let's hop out and hop down here. A couple of things I got to do. Holy smokes. Okay, we got a defense installation. Well, it was deserted when the Explorer team was here, but it looks like we've got uh, defense locations. Two, two defense locations. Huh, okay, great. Anyway, so we're not far, so I can get gravel and stuff to convert this thing over. Let me do a couple of things here. Uh... Get rid of that. And so we got the respawn pod. So, the first task is here. And once I get uh, this uh, respawn pod uh, kind of set up and moving, I'll give you a little bit of history about uh, the uh, uh, Intergalactic uh, Mining and uh, Salvage Company and what they're uh, wanting me to do here. So, although first couple of things, we will, let's take a look at, uh, they said that they had found an iron field and that there was a crash saucer there. So that's one of the things that we are wanting to do is eventually get to that. And then that, again, that's part of the salvage company. And then the other one was where they've left the mobile rover that we've got to get to that there was an also an old, uh, looked like an old mining settlement that was there, and that's where they found cobalt. And where the mobile rover is, they said they found iron. So, it would appear that uh, we're about 50 kilometers away, and so I guess the first thing I gotta do is start getting some gravel. Uh, what I'm gonna do is convert this to a uh, rover and so what we'll do is we'll grind some of this down uh, we'll pull uh, the seed out 
and then uh, we'll put wheels on this thing and once I can get the wheels up. So I gotta build pistons and so I need to get a few things for those parts right there. So once I get a little farther along with the uh, build on the rover, uh, actually once I get some gravel and stuff built up and get some parts, I'll uh, catch back up with you all. So I'll uh, catch up with you here in just a little bit. Okay, so I have been working away trying to figure this out. <coughs> uh, getting a little bit of gravel or stone so I could uh, make parts. I've got my uh, cab in and uh, so that's in. I've got wheels on here. I just got to build them out but I've only got a little bit of small tubes to work with and so I'll finish building these out uh, when I uh, once I get the other side on so I gotta pull this off pull the piston off and we can do that now actually let me uh, lower let's uh, reverse the piston let's get into here piston and let's uh, reverse it and hop out so the one thing I'm gonna have to deal with is I have a problem with I need large tubes and I can't make large tubes so I'm gonna leave the tires as is I'll build as much as I can on them I'll put the steel and the construction components and have all the steel in there. It'll just be missing the large tubes. And hopefully that's going to allow them to be able to function. This part I can build out. I'll have just enough small tubes that I can build. Uh, the uh, uh, IMSC gave me some small tubes to come down with and so that gave me just enough to be able to do what I need to do so I'll be able to build this out and have the main frame uh, solid uh, these will get built out matter of fact I can do these because they are just one steel tube and let's get that done and so I got to do the same thing on this other side so, let me uh, grind this off. Don't want to grind too much. Ah, oh, come on. There we go. Alright. Okay. So now let's raise the other side. I can put that. Let's see. I should be able to stick it right on the side right here. Right there. Let's build it out. All right. And then we should be able to just raise it one meter. Let's get into the control panel. Piston. Raise it one meter. And reverse. Alright, let's see how that did. Okay, that's got this tipped up, okay. All right, well, I tell you what. Once I get back into this thing, uh, I get, let me get uh, the uh, wheels on this side built out, which means I gotta put them in right here, I believe. Yeah, put it right here. Yeah. 
and then uh, I should have enough room. All right. Once I uh, get the uh, other wheels about ready to weld up, I'll uh, catch back up with you all. Okay, well, we're getting close to the moment of truth. I need to build these out. So let me see what we, how much uh, I can, of this I can build. All right, that's completely built. Oh, we can catch these. All right. Did I get everything on that? Yeah, I did, okay. There we go. All right, this one's built. And let's see. A uh, couple of steel plates. Let's see what I need over here. Uh, steel plates. Well, I should be able to make those. Uh, production. Let's go. Ten. Fifteen. That should give us enough steel plates. And we should have enough stuff here to be able to build it. Alright. Let's grab that. Okay. That's what we need here. That one has the construction. We just need some more steel plates. Uh, steel plates. Steel plates. Now I could dismantle this to get a couple of more tubes off of it. One more, anyway. And that should have given us... Alright. Let's get some more... Let's see if we got enough to do ten. I'm not sure... So that one's done. Alright, that's as much steel plate as we can put on there. We got one tire that's actually complete. And so we're missing steel plates. grab a little more gravel just to get enough to make some steel plates. I don't necessarily want to uh, carve down on this just for the integrity, I guess. And yeah, so let me go get some more gravel and then I'll catch back up with you here in a little bit. All right, I've got everything done here. Uh, I've already removed the landing gear. Let's see if we can make this thing move forward a little bit. Uh, I won't set anything up just yet. But let's... Uh, All 
right. Of course, we've got the fog coming in. I got one. Well, that's not the way I want to go. All right. I think we can make it work. I don't have anything in the way of steering because those front tires are not done. Let's see. See if we can get going forward. Oh, come on, come on. might have to build this thing out. Let's see if we can get closer to shore over there. This is not doing what I wanted it to do. Don't want to get over close to that. Come on, I want to see how it does. Let's see, let's see if I can adjust. Let's see what my adjustments are on these things. Uh, what if... Let's see. That should be... That should be the one that's complete. And if we... Give it a little less power and maybe a little less strength, a little less friction. Let's see if we can.
All right. Let's just kind of go with it that way. A lot of spinning around. Yeah, I'm going to need, I'm just going to have to build those tubes. Okay. Got my trusty co-pilot here. Ah. Oh. A lot of spinning around in circles. I think if I... Oh, I just wanted to get closer to shore. It's just not going to let me get any closer, is it? All right, well, I think this is a good spot to call it. Actually, you know what I'm going to do? Let me see if I, I'm going to, I'm going to do a little more work on it and see if I can't get this to straighten out a little bit. And then uh, I will catch back up with here in just a little bit, but we're probably getting close to calling this good. For the video today anyway but uh let me see what we can do here but i'll get catch back up with here in just a little bit well as you can see i've managed to get it over on land and i also have been able to get further away from the uh, uh enemy bases over there so let's see now the problem is, it's taking a lot of power, but I am able to get this rolling down the road. So let's just see. I put a, uh, a gyro on there, and I think that has helped make the difference. Now let's see what we can do. I didn't want to go the other direction so I suppose let's see I've got to get around these mountains and I think we're going to call it good right here yeah yep we're gonna call it good right here all right well this was day one season two the Intergalactic Mining and Salvage Company missions. The plan is to get over and build a base uh, where I can salvage and mine and try to do as much stuff as an automated fashion. Ultimately get a uh, depository up on an asteroid so that the company ships can come in and pick them up and uh, yeah so we're going to try to uh, accomplish that. All right, all you space engineers, if you enjoyed the video, please hit that thumbs up. Uh, I'm sure as we get a little farther along, it's going to smooth out a little bit, hopefully, and we're not going to run into too much uh, danger and problems. And so, yeah. Well, if you like that video, hit that thumbs up. Uh, it really helps the video out a lot and uh, please subscribe that really helps the channel out a lot and with that commander kingfish is out of here and we'll see you all in the next video thanks for watching everyone